I'm meteorologist Mark Van Cuso, and on this day in weather history, September 9, 1775, a violent hurricane struck off the eastern coast of Newfoundland. Known as the Independence Day Hurricane, it first struck the Outer Banks of North Carolina on August 29th and turned northeastward on the 2nd. It brought savage conditions with heavy rain and powerful winds to southeastern Virginia, killing almost 170 as ships foundered or washed ashore. Numerous mill dams were destroyed, and crop fields and fodder were a total loss. It's uncertain if the storm remained a hurricane after it passed the Carolinas, but it slammed Newfoundland a week later. A storm surge 20 to 30 feet drowned thousands of English and Irish sailors. It was reported that ocean levels rose to heights scarcely ever known before. Losses from the storm included two armed schooners of the Royal Navy, which were ported on the Grand Banks to enforce fishing rights. Overall, it's believed to have killed over 4,000 people, making it one of the deadliest Atlantic hurricanes of all time. I'm meteorologist Mark Mancuso.